Hey everybody, welcome back to Fade to Silence. Uh, we... We're surviving. We're surviving. We got a lot that we need to work on, though. And, uh... Well, it's not amazing weather out there, is it? No, it isn't. Let's, uh, let's check our map and figure out where we want to be heading to. I think we're gonna try and clear this outpost. Uh, we do have some mining capabilities over here, but we don't have the requirements. So along the way, we're gonna try and grab a few things, and then maybe we'll check out a stronghold soon enough. I'd like to try and find a, uh, a companion. That would be pretty beneficial to us, I think. I should also add, thanks again to THQ for sponsoring this video. Really appreciate it. Very cool of you guys. It's like very, very foggy out here. I don't think I've ever seen it like this, actually. It's kind of cool. It's like... Whoa, what was that? Is that us? I can't be the only person that heard that. What is that? Just gonna grab everything that we can. Are we able to see our marker when it's like this? Nope, not looking great. Not looking great. Alright, so let's... Oh, that's weird. My marker position's all borked. Alright. We can see it on the, uh, on the compass at the top, so at least we've got that going for us. Here we go. When you see yellow, that's a good sign. So I did mention it a couple of times in the last um, in the last video, but um, I am giving away a few copies of this. So if you guys are interested, I'm just going to be doing a random uh, draw from any of the comments, and uh, I'll try to hook you guys up. Uh, the other thing is that. I've got uh, three names that I can choose that will actually go in the credits of the game. Um, just because you guys were participating and watching some early content. So, if you're interested in that, uh, come over to the Discord and say hi and let me know that you're interested in that kind of thing. And uh, I'll do a draw over there in a little while, so. Alright, Blightbane, Bloodhog, Grubroot, let's go. This is good. Grub root and fiber. All right, let's, uh, while we're here, let's just take a bite to eat here. That's pretty good. I think we can craft some food. We have a lot of grub root, and it will take some, one of our fires, but that's okay. Just so that we have that ready. I should also consider... I should also consider crafting um, a poultice. What the hell? That is so creepy. <laughs> what is happening? There's something weird here. Okay, okay. Look at this! What is happening? Did you see that car flying in the background? There we go. Oh no, we missed him! All right, well, luckily... Oh, that felt good. That felt good. That was a solid connection. Man down. All right, there is pristine wood here. Nice. Oh, that's huge. Okay, we're gonna have to keep an eye out for these little wood piles, I suppose. Could be pretty handy. We can finally get uh, our own axe now. This is great news. Let's go. 
<clears throat> I don't know if this is a recent update or addition, but they now show you how many lives you have left at the top. Remember earlier I was saying that when you die, um... Which way were we heading? Uh, when you die, one of those candles goes out. And you only have a limited amount. Well, that's your amount. Look at that thing. No thank you. Now these guys just seem to be coming up out of nothing. I'm gonna try to ignore- oh, there's a bunch of stuff back there too, actually. Alright, let's open up these. Primitive arrows, healing tonic food. Oh, this is- that was like winning the lottery out here. Probably not worth it to just run in there and use the heavy attack. It leaves ourselves pretty exposed. That'll do. Okay, let's be very quiet over here. I'm not interested. Okay, hunting arrows. Nice. Too bad we don't have a bow. Okay, so he's guarding the... He's guarding the blight that we're going to try and clear here. Which means if we're going to do this, we got to be super quick about it. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait for him to start turning around and then we'll run in and try cleanse this thing. Oh, are you serious? This is gonna cause us a problem, isn't it? Yeah, that guy's coming in here now. It's go time. And go time... By go time, I mean time to... Time to run. We need to warm up anyway. Jeez. Alright, so we've got some stuff out here. Oh, what? They're very active. Not good. Not good at all. Okay, I'm, we're gonna run for safety here, I think. I wonder if there's anything that dictates, like, how aggressive they are, or how many of them will show up in a certain area. Because, uh, that was pretty gnarly, and I would rather not just die right now. But that's the thing, how far do you want to push out before knowing that you don't have safety behind you, you know? That's the worry. Alright, so we've got a healing tonic. Slowly restores the maximum health. Let's get one of these going. We've got uh, fiber. Seems like this is all that we use grub root for. Oh no, we use it in the. Uh, that's right, we use it in the food. But fiber we're gonna need for the bow. We get enough pristine wood, which we had only seen one so far. 
So I think we can just hold. All right, let's have a snack. Twenty-five degrees in oh jeez, twenty-five degrees in here. Now, do I want to venture back out that way, or what is this? It's a star. I don't. Oh, recruit. Oh, nice. All right, we'll have to like. This might have been because they changed my resolution, so I'm not sure if that's totally the game's fault. But let's go get a let's go get a follower. I'm gonna go ahead and guess that that's probably easier said than done, but... I wish we had a, uh... Some semblance of time. That looks pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. Oh boy. We got cleansing to do. Oh, he's in there! Wow. Let's go. Come on. I'll take it. Oh no. Oh no, don't tell me. You all right? Splendid. Whoa. <laughs> no way. Now you will pay for Okay, this. this is great. Oh my god. We got to knock out the survivor. I mean, that looks pretty knocked out to me. <laughs> Come on, Reese. I didn't ask for this, buddy. I don't want to kill him either, though. I'm dying. We just got food from that car, don't too. How do I revive him? Oh, I gotta cleanse him. Won't last. Come on. Much longer. Come on, Reese. Come on, Reese. Stay with me. There we go. Got you. That was close. T too close. All right, buddy. Welcome to the team. This is great. How did you wind up wrapped in Hellvines? It was an accident. Not something one does for fun. Much obliged. Oh. Uh. Let's be cool. Happens to the best of us. Happens to the best of us. As planets move relentlessly, most would have kept walking. But you halted your orbit and fought. In any case, I won't re-replicate this experiment. Wait. You've done that before? A story for another time, perhaps. Fair enough. Okay, so... This is Reese. It's got high health, high morale. Good sign. Story. Continuously... Or continually... Investigating corruption. And searching for a way to turn it... To his advantage, Reese is determined to find a way to defeat the Eclipse. Exposure to the Blight has led him to develop strange side effects, though. Reese may have true prophetic insight into the Eclipse's power, or it may have broken his mind. He's proficient in hunting, construction, occultism, and so everything. 
metalworking, occultism. He is driven to study every ounce of corruption he can find, and more essence is skillfully extracted when monsters are defeated. Followers will automatically try to eat food from your stash every day. If they can't, they will slowly starve. Join the camp. I could use another pair of hands in my camp, and, uh, I'd like to hear that story. I could... use a sanctuary. Nice. All right, so we can assign them to build things or gather materials. Um, they will improve our current buildings and we can have them craft better equipment or defend, raise palisades and defenses, fight together against monster raids. Are they gonna eventually raid our base? That is kind of scary. So how do I get a view of what's happening here? Disband inventory overview, all right. So there's Reese. Shows us his level of equipment, which is basic. Super basic. All he's got is... Oh, that's maybe us. I have a feeling that's probably us. We're on day three, which is nice. What can I get him... Oh, here we go. Details. Remove from expedition. Stop priority task. If we go here, we can assign workers now to these different areas uh, to do things for us. So, food-wise, I think we're okay. I'm hoping that this can get us pristine wood if we assign him to this. We have to remove him from our expedition first. I wonder if we should cruise around with him. Let's see. Let's cruise around with him for a bit and see what he can get us get us into. Uh, let's see if we can't clear out <laughs> that camp. Is there anything in this area? Oh, yeah. Looks like salvage. It's salvage. Some essence. Now I'm going to have to hope that he can kind of hold his own because... All we've got is- all we've got is a, basically a wooden stick to fight with. I mean, let's be real. Whoa! Look at this big boy. Can't see anything. Get him, Reese. Okay, you whiffed. Press on. Only the Jeez. Don't push forward. Man, I can't wait till they act like if they actually get this thing optimized and running really smoothly. We'd be laughing. Pristine wood? Wait, what did that just say? Your current health recovers more quickly than your maximum health. Rest at the campfire or shelter to restore your health. Yes, okay. Uh, we also have... We also have... This one. So let's boost the recovery of our maximum health a little bit. And then... I guess we could eat... And maybe make a poultice. Oh, we had a bunch. Let's do a few of those. Okay, our inventory's on max. I think we can store stuff back at our home base, if I'm not mistaken. Jeez. Can we get out through here? No. All right, Reese, on me, buddy. On me. So I'm wondering if we shouldn't maybe head back home here.
I think that might be wise. We'll see if we have some storage there. And then we can drop some supplies as well. Now, one thing I worry about is... Would he just run off and fight something if we didn't ask him to? If it's close to us? Or how is that going to work? See, so this thing that just got highlighted here, I'm pretty sure is... Well, maybe not. I was going to say maybe it's like a wood area, but... I think it's just a place of interest where we can grab stuff. It's... Oh no, maybe I'm onto something. I don't know what that said. Whoa! Destroy the resistance. Oh, wow! Whoa! Okay, so this is like totally worth it. All right, all right, all right, all right. This is huge. This is huge. Wrap yourself in my white blanket. Is there a way I can, like, drop stuff, though? Doesn't look like it. Oh, here, yes, drop item. Let's get the good stuff, at least. So let's take the... Oh, slightly blighted chunks of wood that can be processed to firewood by a follower with a woodcutting skill. All right, so I grabbed the pristine stuff, I guess. Let's just take the regular firewood then. Call it a day. Now, can this happen on any tree in here? Looks like it. But let's, uh, we'll come back to this. We'll come back to this. So I imagine once we want to start upgrading our base that it's going to require a lot of materials, so... Let's see if we can make it back safe. Starts to, you know, you start to look at this, right? And you think, well... We're gonna... There's not a lot of stuff to do. <laughs> but it's like... It just seems to never end. Oh, really? That was unfortunate. That was not amazing. It's fine. We're gonna be resting soon. Oh, he's got bow and arrow. Nice. I like that, Reese. Nice job, dude. Alright, we're getting super cold, so... Let's hit the warmth. Call it a night. Expedition over. Your follower get back to work. Okay. Whoa, our camp's under attack? Proficient hunters, woodcutters, metalworkers gather meat. Alright. What the frick is happening? I am not happy about this. Reese? Oh, they died. Oh, wait. They died. 
Does that mean that... Did that crystal thing kill them? I wonder. I wonder. All right. Let's get uh, let's get a solid eight hours. All right, cool. Now there's probably a lot of things that I could be doing way more efficiently, but since I'm going into this basically fresh, um, I'm kind of looking forward to. I'm kind of looking forward to just figuring things out. Uh, proficient followers can construct buildings much more quickly than unskilled ones. Press up, construct buildings to gain access to new tools and resources. Expedition. Oh, construct. Oh, cool. All right, so this, this is great. We got a hut, medicine hut, crafting shack, forge, workshop. Sled kennel? Shelter for the wolves you domesticated. Oh, sick. Occult laboratory. Palisade. Keep monsters out for a while. Alright. That actually seems like not a terrible idea, but it's it's a lot of wood. We do have those trees that we can cut down, obviously. But I think if we start at least by building maybe a fence across here... Maybe this is just, like, the plan, and then eventually these guys build it. Now, how do I find... What is he doing? Let's assign you. Oh, hello. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to figure out how to get him building stuff for us. And then uh, we'll just go from there. Because I have no clue how to get him to build stuff. But we're going to figure it out, and it's going to be good. Maybe modify? Select a follower and add him to the exploration team. Select a party. We'll depart for exploration. I don't really want to do that. Maybe what I need to do... Can I find him while he's not recruited? It says he should be, like, over here. Jeez, this is terrible. Oh, look at this. We're not getting anywhere tonight. Use the Eclipse's eyes and look for a blue light pillar for shelter. All right, all right. Oh, and here's our storage, I think. Refuge stash. Whoa. Where did this all come from? This is nice. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Let's put some stuff in here. I don't think I need the ore out there. Eldritch Essence. Arrowheads. Pristine wood. I think I'll just keep it here. Actually, we might be able to build a, uh, a bow now. All right, I'm going to take a break here. When we come back, I'm going to do a couple of other things. Hopefully, we uh, can sit through this blizzard and find our buddy and get him to start building some things. That would be nice. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. We'll see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.